Astonishing Stories Behind Failed Assassination Attempts We recently examined recorded figures who barely kept away from less than ideal passings unintentionally, sickness, or death. The last is an antiquated apparatus for holding on to power, obliterating an adversary, or essentially as a methods for retribution. Regardless of being fruitless, a few endeavors have gotten instilled in history and still, small voice, others have become comical accounts about the proposed casualties character, and still others have prompted vicious retaliations. Number 1 China's First Emperor versus A Gigantic Hammer By 218 BC, Qin Shi Huang controlled as China's first head. En route, he squashed six adversary realms. A man referred to later as Zhang Liang swore retaliation on the sovereign, as a few individuals from his family were cleared out by the Qin surge. Zhang sold all that he claimed with the expectation of employing somebody to take Qin out. Such an individual emerged as an anonymous meandering strongman who used a gigantic iron sledge said to have weighed more than 60 kilograms, 132 pounds. The two trapped the sovereign as his carriage passed, and the strongman tossed his weapon with such power that it totally obliterated the carriage. Lamentably for Zhang, the superbly embellished carriage was just a bait. At the point when he understood his mistake, both he and his strong associate immediately fled the scene. Nobody realizes what happened to the strongman, yet Zhang needed to change his name from his unique family name, G, to sidestep catch. He would later pick up some proportion of retribution when he rose to unmistakable quality as one of the mainstays of the Han Dynasty, which superseded the Qin to run China. Number 2 Charles de Gaulle owed his life to a car By 1962, the Citroen DS had become the vehicle of decision for France's political and social tip-top. It was an especially decent decision for French President Charles de Gaulle, as the model's plan saved his life. On August 22, de Gaulle and his company were headed to the air terminal when men from the organisation de l'armée secrète, secret army organisation, who trusted de Gaulle sold out French interests by surrendering Algeria, started shooting. Two of the president's protectors were slaughtered in a hail of 140 projectiles, which broke the back window and extinguished the entirety of the Citroën's tires. The vehicle went to a front-wheel slide, yet because of the Citroën's novel suspension framework, the driver had the option to recapture control and drive de Gaulle and his better half to well-being. De Gaulle stayed a deep-rooted ally of Citroën. He even mediated to forestall the organization's deal to Italian organization Fiat, and later on, the French government financed the offer of Citroën to its rival, another French organization called Peugeot. Number 3 The Seven Assassination Attempts on Queen Victoria Sovereign Victoria was the objective of seven death endeavors during the almost 64 years of her rule. One attacker was a jobless barman who employed two guns. The two shots missed, however had they not, it would have finished the Saxe Coburg Gotha line. Another was a hunchbacked bantam whose firearm didn't fire. One man figured out how to draw near enough to the sovereign to cut at her face with a stick, darkening her eye and leaving the welt. Another pushed his gun in the sovereign's face before it was thumped away by a worker. Another was an unsettled sociopath with an obsession with the otherworldly. One man, named John Francis, was really answerable for two endeavors. During his initially bungled endeavor, he fled before he could get his shot off, yet he was spotted by a few men, including Prince Albert. The following day, Queen Victoria and Prince Albert intentionally coaxed him back into public to make a second endeavor on her life. Francis acknowledged the demand however bombed again, bringing about his capture and expulsion. Please like share the video and subscribe for more videos to the channel. Number 4 Abraham Lincoln was shot through the hat One August night in 1864, President Abraham Lincoln was taking a relaxed horseback ride when an uproarious break was heard. His pony fiercely jogged away, taking Lincoln to the principal street where one of his protectors noticed that Lincoln was done wearing his unmistakable formal hat. The president tranquilly clarified that something had frightened his pony, and trying to recapture control, he had lost his cap. The following day, Lincoln's formal hat was found, yet it bore a fresh out-of-the-box new element, a projectile opening. Somebody had terminated at the president and missed by simple inches. At the point when Lincoln was recounted this, he nonchalantly advised the men to keep the occurrence calm. Adding I can't force myself to accept that anybody has shot me or will intentionally take shots at me with the conscious motivation behind killing me. Sadly, after eight months in Ford's theater, he was refuted.
Number 5 King Zog survived over 50 assassination attempts. Sovereign Victoria has nothing on King Zog I of Albania, who purportedly endured 55 death endeavors. As you would envision, the Lord wasn't actually very much cherished, having brought about upwards of 600 blood grudges against him during his life. One of these feuds came to fruition because of Zog's messed up commitment to a lady in the wake of turning out to be above all else. Zog at last turned out to be so unfortunate in doubting that he utilized his own mom to administer his kitchens to guarantee that his food wasn't harmed. Remarkable endeavors on his life incorporate one that occurred during a visit to a drama house in Vienna, where he effectively fought off his assailants by restoring their gunfire. Another endeavor happened in 1924, when a political opponent's ally shot him on his approach to parliament. A firefight resulted, and once the aggressor was curbed, Zog reported, Honorable men. This isn't the first run through such a thing has occurred. I request that my companions disregard it and manage it thereafter. The most yearning plot was concocted by Italians who had forced an old companion of the ruler, paying him 10 million lire to submit regicide. Had the arrangement succeeded, Italian specialists were to incite road battles in the resistance of mountain clans. The resulting disorder would have caused Albanians to ask for Italy to re-establish a range and involve the realm.